Hi guys, welcome back. I'm home now, so I wanted to show you guys what I ended up picking up from the Dollar Tree. So I've got all my goodies in the Cinderella bag. So let me show you what I was able to find, you guys. I was so excited about these little carrots. Um, they're just little decoration pieces for, I'm going to be decorating my coffee bar, as you all know. I love to decorate my coffee bar and you guys really liked how I decorated it for Valentine's Day using all Dollar Tree items. So I'm going to do the same for Easter and of course I'll be sure to show you guys what it ends up looking like. So I picked up these carrots. They're super adorable. I'm so excited. I'm either going to make a garland out of these or even I can just stick them um, kind of everywhere and kind of make it seem like the Easter Bunny was there or whatever. So, super cute, you guys. These are amazing for a dollar. You get four little carrots. They don't look like they come from the Dollar Tree, if you know what I mean. They're super nice quality. It's kind of like an orange twine wrapped around the carrot. Super pretty and definitely worth a buck. I bought a bunch of like cutesy cutesy stuff again. I have a problem with the section for like the impulse buys. At least that's what the box says. Impulse purchasing. So I'll show you guys that in a minute. But I did pick up these little napkins. I didn't, I wasn't a huge fan of all the different um, napkins that they had for Easter. I only liked certain ones, but I wasn't like sold if you know what I mean. But I really liked these. They're like pastel colors and I don't know. I just felt like the other ones looked a little bit too cheap if you know what I mean. So I always try to do like super cute stuff on a budget. I don't want it to look cheap. I don't want it to look like I went to the Dollar Tree. So that's not really what I'm going for. I kind of want expensive look on a budget if you know what I mean. I think that's what we all want. These to say party napkins, happy Easter. And um... I'm going to use these on my coffee bar as well. The next items I was really excited about are these, um, the micellar cleansing water, you guys. Let me know if you want me to test these out. I might actually remove my makeup with this tonight. So I'm really intrigued and curious. So this is by the brand Daily Defense. This pink one is in dry and sensitive skin soothes and moisturizes all in one no rinsing no alcohol no residue gently removes makeup and impurities let me know if you would like me to test this for you guys to see if it's like worth your money or not this one is in like it's got like blue right here and it says all skin types even sensitive it says it claims to cleanse and hydrate your skin all in one no rinsing no alcohol no residue Gently removes makeup and impurities. I'm super excited. They're eight fluid ounces. And this isn't cheap, you guys. I normally get my Garnier one. This is the one that I use. It's the Garnier Skin Active Micellar Cleansing Water All-in-One. Um, no rinse, no harsh rubbing, no, no oil, alcohol, fragrance. So... I'm curious to know if these are essentially the same thing, but I'm also afraid that if I love this product and Dollar Tree doesn't put it out anymore, like what am I supposed to do? <laughs> do you guys know what I mean? Like they'll put out like some amazing product and then they completely get rid of it. So I don't know if this is one of those products, but I'm really excited to test them out. So give this video a thumbs up if you would like me to remove my makeup on camera for you guys so you can kind of check it out or maybe I'll do that anyway since I'm going to remove my makeup anyway right I've got nothing to lose by sharing this stuff with you guys since we all love the Dollar Tree so much right I about flipped out when I saw these now I didn't see the pink one and I think there's like a teal looking one like a greenish one but I did find these they are little tape dispensers. They're so freaking cute. This is the blue one and this is the purple one. They're super adorable. They do have kind of like the sprinkles on the top of them. And you guys know that I love 
stationery, anything to do with stationery. It's like my favorite thing in the world. So when I saw these, I was like super excited. I didn't find the pink one, so I'll be on the hunt. You better believe. I don't care how many Dollar Trees I have to visit. I'm going to find the pink one. So those were super awesome. It also says it includes the tape which is super awesome, so it's like two in one. I also found these adorable little wristlets, and I love them because they don't have any design or print or pattern. They're just like a metallic pouch. These are amazing for making your own emergency kits for your handbags, your purses. I can't even tell you guys. Um, I'll have to show you guys, but I have like a little pouch filled with like Advil, Excedrin, um, Alka-Seltzer, like you name it, band-aids, uh, hair ties. That's kind of like my little emergency pouch and that's what I plan to do with these. They're super pretty. Look you guys, you can even make a cute little gift. I was going to show you guys this because I didn't even plan this out. It just kind of happened. But look, look, got purple and purple. Like yes, Dollar Tree, this is amazing for like a cute little gift. Um, I mean, I'm not like super young or anything, but I love these cutesy cutesy stuff. I don't care. I don't care if I'm 80 years old. You better believe I'm still going to be rocking this cute stuff because I just love it. All right. Let me show you these adorable little pens that would go really cute with, you know, like a little, oh my goodness, you could even do a cute little Easter basket with these, like for your girlfriends, your sisters, your aunts, your mom, your grandma, whoever was into this stuff. They're super freaking cute. I can't get over them. They've got like the furry stuff going on. You guys know I'm like crazy for furry stuff like this. It's so stinking adorable. So they've got a purple, a teal, and a pink. These are the only ones they had at my Dollar Tree, so I wouldn't be able to tell you if they had more, but this was in the impulse section. That's where I do most of my shopping. <laughs> Because it's just so cute and it's like always new stuff. So I love shopping that little section. And my Dollar Tree has that like towards the front where the registers are. So I always make sure to like swing by the Dollar Tree and check that section because that's like their new section. But obviously check the stationery. They could possibly put it in that area. But look. Oh my god. I can't get over how cute this stuff is. You could do the little flamingo pen, the little donut tape dispenser, the little pouch, and a little like notebook or something from Dollar Tree and you've got yourself a really nice gift for Easter for somebody that's into this cute stuff, right? Talking about flamingos, found this little pom-pom clip and I love, I love this you guys. When I saw this, it reminded me of a beach bag like this is super awesome to clip onto a beach bag sort of thing and it's got its little dangling flamingo legs like can we say more about the dangling legs like I literally die for dangling legs they're so freaking adorable and um, they're super cute like you guys know I have a thing for pom-pom keychains pom-pom furry things they're just so cute sparkly things like, come on. That is so good, Dollar Tree. Leilani picked up this pack of Smarties for a dollar, you guys. I'm not into Smarties or anything, but this is a 2.25 ounce. We went to a candy store. Um, I think it's called, like, Sweet Shop or something along those lines on Old Town Temecula. The same thing was, like, $2.25, you guys. So I got it for a dollar at the Dollar Tree. That's the place to go. That is a good deal, and that's why I love shopping Dollar Tree. Okay, moving right along, I picked up a powder brush. Now, I don't know, I haven't been very lucky to find the entire collection, because I know they've got, like, all sorts of different brushes. Um, but I've picked up a couple brushes here and there from this collection, um, which is kind of like that, like, whimsical mermaid unicorn um, you know collection that they have out it's not the best quality brush so let me be honest 99 cent store is the place to go to get your makeup brushes if you don't know highly highly recommend you check out the 99 cent store um, but I don't know I was intrigued and it's always nice to have um, 
you know, a little brush. I have a ton of makeup brushes. But that would also be a great gift in the, you know, the whole little Easter basket we're doing here. Okay, guys, the next thing I'm so excited about. I'm excited about everything because I'm 10 years old. Hello, nice to meet you. <laughs> I've also been feeling a little bit under the weather lately, but I'm getting better now. Sometimes I feel like it wants to come back and haunt me, but um, we're fighting through it. I had like a really bad cold and cough and like I just wanted to be under my blanket, you guys. There was no way I could function. Like I tried going to work and I couldn't, like I couldn't function. Like I felt so, so tired and so sick. Like you know, like, I tried to show up to work, I tried to do my job, but I couldn't. Anyway. Okay, so these are the little candles, you guys. They are so cute. This would also be amazing for an Easter basket or for Christmas or whatever. I'm thinking Easter because it's, like, right around the corner. But if you want to do, like, a little tea gift basket with, like, different tea flavors, like, different tea bags, these are pure tea leaf scented candles you guys how cute would that be and tea you can find tea boxes at the dollar tree or the 99 cent store they have some really amazing ones you guys that would also be a really cute gift for somebody that's into tea i love tea you guys i love coffee more than tea but i do love a nice you know cup of tea like i do so this one here is by old williamsburg you guys know i love this person I don't know if this is a guy, um, is it a last name? I'm not sure you guys, but I like it. They usually come in the little mason jar and this one is an herbal mint. However, this tastes just like that stress relief eucalyptus lotion from Bath and Body Works. Yes, it does. Oh my goodness. I actually need to get me some of that because I used that up real quick. I got like a free sample, not a sample, but it was like a mini size and I used it up. I actually want to get the big size because I loved it. It's definitely relaxing just to relieve some of the stress because life can get crazy, you guys. It can get crazy. But this is this smells just like that. I guarantee it for a dollar and it's a little candle. Probably put it next to my little nightstand. Yes! Just, you know, for a relaxing moment. Okay, this here is Earl Grey. I used to have a manager that loved Earl Grey tea. And definitely reminds me of her. She was a sweetheart, you guys. Um, so, got that. Okay, what else? Okay, yeah, you've probably seen these little keychains. You better believe I had to have them you guys they're so freaking adorable this one here says BAM and it's green it's got like little like rhinestone type things a little tassel and like a little ball type thing this one looks like a superhero sort of thing with a purple little tassel it's got a little clip and all and this one says pow and it's pink and all of that it's so stinking cute and originally i wasn't going to pick these up but then they gave me like halloween vibes and you guys know that i love to switch out my handbags by the way guys i do sell handbags on the side i'll link my poshmark down below i'm selling a few i listed a few new ones so I'll leave my posh mark down below so you can check it out if you're interested in buying a handbag. I feel like I'm getting a runny nose. But they gave me Halloween vibes, like costumes. You know what I mean, right? So I had to pick them up. Um, I can always stick them in a Halloween inspired bag that I'm selling or whatever the case is. I like to add cute stuff like that on my handbags. Jelani also picked these up. These are the Philly Swirl Cotton Candy little, like, lol, not lollipops, popsicle type things. She picked these out. Now, a little suggestion or a little tip. 
Um, she wanted to go in the section where they only sell one for a dollar. Do you know what I'm saying? It's like that little refrigerator towards the registers. Like she wanted to get an ice cream from there. Little tip. This comes with six for a dollar, you guys. So go to like the freezer section at your Dollar Tree and you're going to get a much better deal for a dollar. Just FYI. Alright guys, so that basically concludes this haul in this video. I hope you enjoyed. Give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, your family, whoever you know that enjoys the Dollar Tree as much as we do. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. And I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!